She should have been celebrating her 20th birthday this month. Instead, all her family has left are these old photos. They show what Madeline McCann looked like when she vanished without a trace 16 years ago. Now suddenly, this cold case is heating back up. No parent's going to give up on their child unless they know for certain their child's dead and that we just don't have any evidence. The parents of Madeline McCann still holding out hope that one of the world's most famous missing persons cases will be solved. And for the first time in several years, there's movement. Portuguese police are now searching near a dam in the southern region of Algarve. The body of water is about 50 kilometers away from the beach resort where Madeline went missing in 2007. The young girl vanished from a rented apartment while on a family vacation. A major search operation is taking place. I cannot disclose the background. That is to remain our secret for the moment. Sources say the operation is being carried out at the request of German authorities, who have previously stated they believe Madeline is no longer alive. A former detective who once played a central role in the investigation supports the new effort. It simply put, it's the right thing to do. The, the German prosecutor and the German police have a suspect, a credible suspect. They have some information that they're not sharing with the wider public. The suspect is Christian Bruckner, a convicted child abuser and drug dealer. He is currently behind bars in Germany for raping a 72-year-old woman in the same area where the McCann family was vacationing. German police named him as a suspect in Madeline's disappearance three years ago, but he has denied any involvement and has not been formally charged. A source within the Portuguese police says there is little hope that the reservoir search will actually provide any new leads, but the activity is providing hope to those who have spent the past 16 years wondering what happened to Madeline. Yes, at some stage, you know, luck has to turn, you know, the right thing needs to happen so that the parents uh, of Madeline, Kate and Jerry uh, get some kind of peace and that the rest of the world finds out what happened to Madeleine McCann. For City News, I'm Karen Seolan.